A great dish for the barbecue or the grill is chicken seasoned with a paste which is made from curry powder, stock cube and a little bit of olive oil. If you haven't got the time to make a curry sauce, this is a great alternative way of using curry. We've all got it in the back of our kitchen cupboards. So, one chicken stock cube, a little oil and a tiny bit of fresh rosemary which is optional. If you haven't got rosemary, use a bit of thyme, it works very well with curry. So as you can see, I've dissolved the stock cube with the oil and with the rosemary. Then we add some curry powder. And again, it's your choice how much curry powder. i am just put a generous pinch in there. So now we dissolve the curry powder into the oil in the stock cube with the fresh rosemary. And there's our seasoning paste. We all love a curry, but we haven't got time to make one sometimes. So therefore, a great alternative is to make the paste massage the spice in. So what we're really doing is putting more flavour into our chicken. The difference between making a paste with stock cube and a bit of oil, when you grill it on the grill or on the barbecue, it doesn't burn. A lot of the things that we buy, they burn before what we're cooking is cooked. So I'd always recommend to make a paste with stock cubes. So then what we do, we take our chicken, we place it paste side down first, and then we put a little bit more on the other side. And the secret of grilling is always to get your pan really hot. If it's not hot, it'll stick. So as you can see now, I've turned off the gas. There's sufficient heat in my pan to continue the grilling. So I have no fears of it burning or overcooking. You can see the paste is still on the chicken. A little fresh olive oil. And so now that will cook for about another two minutes, very gently, in the pan, the gas has been turned off, so it just cooks gently and softly. What I think is important when cooking at home is to use things like seasoning pastes, because not everybody has the technical ability to make a good sauce. So therefore, you can take all those spices and herbs that you like and put them inside the paste and then spread it on. And so it gives you the desired effect without all the aggravation of making a sauce. When I make pastes, I make paste sometimes with cayenne pepper bit of paprika, black pepper, mixed spices, different types of herbs. What it does do, it gives your food that great flavour and that great sense of occasion. And to finish our dish, a tiny bit of olive oil in the watercress. When we think, we think of chicken with curry, it's colonial, it's a natural combination. And then we think of watercress, which is very English, and the two of them work fantastically together. And watercress is very English, and as we all know, it's really good for us. Take a little lemon, and just to finish with a tiny bit of olive oil. The beauty of grilling meats and fish, whether it's in the garden, on a barbecue, whether it's on a griddle pan in the kitchen, it's just very clean food. It's very quick. It works really well with salads, with fresh herbs. And then we have our curried chicken, which has been grilled, with watercress.